Hear me, O oh ye who would murder the Lamb of God. Ye shall never reach her God. Okay. Well, I guess that's one way to start a level. Good thing we were wearing an indestructible metal suit to protect us from explosions and the harsh pressure of deep sea Kid, exploration. Come on, wake up now. There you are. I thought you rode that torpedo into the great hereafter. Oh I'm in Dionysus Park now. Train cars are shambles, leaking air. Whole damn place is flooded and sealed. But there's a pumping station back there on Siren Alley. And I believe you could jerry-rig it to drain the park out. That'd let you stroll right inside. Get to those pumps and hurry. <sighs> so yet again, we have another instance of the most convoluted way of getting to the next level. We've got to reach the farthest reaches of Siren Alley in order to drain this area to head into Dionysus Park, which we actually can't go into because I guess it's flooded? Makes a lot of sense. The park is sealed, Chief. You aren't getting in there just yet. Yeah. But if you get down to that pumping station in Siren Alley and drain the place out, this airlock will let you in. Yep, so eventually we're going to have to come back through here after doing pump business. I see Father Wales has parted you from your craft, and yet you cling to life. Congratulations. Today, Delta, you meet a man who has no fear yeah. of death. And for Eleanor, he would burn with a smile. Yes, indeed. So, um, had we not gotten extremely inconveniently blasted out of our train car there, we wouldn't take a second look at Siren Alley. And thus, the trend continues in Bioshock 2, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to switch some stuff up here real fast because I'm unhappy of how I've been playing lately. So I'm going to take off Cyclone Trap. I'll show it a little bit later. But I think I just want to hold on to Hypnotize right now. I've been playing a little bit too slowly, so we're going to be doing a couple of sequence breaks I've never tried before. So, let's see. A lot of these are really actually pretty decent. I'll have to upgrade my Gene Tonics pretty soon here. But, check it out. We've got ourselves a new Big Daddy here. And this guy, this is called the Rumbler. He's pretty interesting. Um, I mean, for the most part. He basically will shoot explosives at you because he has a grenade launcher. So I'm gonna put a couple rounds into his back. Oh god. And you can actually shoot them back at him. If I didn't fuck this up. Ooh, right there. Shit. Alright. So that wasn't too bad. Um, but if you get like nice and close and personal with this guy, he's actually a, a pushover. So shotgun's your best bet here. Although I haven't like nothing, so. This guy right here. Damn, this fucking. God damn it. Right here. Oh my god. I'm eating these for breakfast and dinner. Holy shit. I've got enough for the entire family. Alright, this guy. This guy's gonna die. So, shotgun rain time. Are you ready for a bit of Tesla in your face? Well, guess what? Boom! Okay, this is not happening. Okay, let's try. There we go. So, he kind of doesn't know what to do when you're up close. He'll drop um, turrets. I think he just dropped one right there. My god. We need to research this guy some more. He, we're not doing anything to him. But there we go. Rumbler's dead. Sorry, little sister. Now, there are three of them in this level. This is going to be a bit of a, I don't know, kind of a long-winded level. And we got our mini turret. Uh, that actually goes on our hack tool, which is really cool. And um, it's very useful for defending, uh, you know, little sisters from their enemies, from the people who want to murder them. So I think we're doing pretty decently right now. We've got phosphorus shots for our shotgun. And this vending machine is going to be our best friend here because we have like four areas we need to discover in this one giant room. So let's take a look. I'm, I have a feeling we're going to be collecting lots of money here. But let's see. We'll also be introduced to a different kind of splicer in this part that can be pretty de deadly. So... I think we're already done with all of these guys. There we go. Oh my god! Right here. Thank you. Alright, thank you, thank you. We're good. What, what the f What the- Where did you come from? How did you even sneak up behind me? Oh my god. Okay, let's- Let's be a little bit more wary of our surroundings here. 
Alright, and this health station is probably going to be a good one to have on our side because um, the corpses in this room, when we're defending them and having the little sister gather at them, it's a pretty good idea to do that nonsense. And they'll usually go for that one health station, so that's good. By God, this game is being ridiculous with its, with its loading. <laughs> Alright, sweet. This ammo bandito. Don't really need to worry about that. Hmm. Alright, I guess we're pretty much good. There's one on an upper floor, and there's one on a bottom floor. The bottom floor one is a son of a bitch to do, so... That was leading to the bottom. Or maybe the top, I don't even remember. Let's see, gotta make sure we're nice and ready for these assholes. Good. And remember, I'm using all of my money because you get so much of it over the course of this game that you literally are gonna fill up on ammo and still be full on things, so... Um, I'm going to use my trap rivets to great extent here. Oh, what lovely textures this game has. So many things. So many. Oh, man. So Siren Alley, I kind of like it. It's a pretty interesting place, in my opinion. And it's pretty fun, but... Oh my, my god! Gather the family. Okay. So that was Father Wales, ladies and gentlemen. The Let's go drop this. Mother of mercy, I think that was Simon Wales. Right. What's he done to himself? He and his brother were Rapture's architects. Sorry. But when Doc Lamb came along, Simon got religion. Mm -mm. He's got a kind of church down in the pumping station. Expect a reckoning when you arrive. Uh, you think I will. <laughs> or you know I will. Okay, so I'm just getting this one out of the way just because we're here, so it's not really too bad. It's just they hide on the fucking top. You know, I'm gonna try something a little different here. God damn it. Okay, you get surrounded here. Maybe if I just make a vantage point that's not like completely out in the open. God. <laughs> this is going swimmingly! There we go. That didn't make any sense. Alright, here. Ugh. Okay. Asshole. Stop this. Stop this madness. Ugh. There we go. Okay, so after we save this little sister, we'll get an ability that makes it a little bit easier to gather Adam. It's just, holy shit, I am getting my detail fucked all over the place. This is great fun, you guys. Oh, okay. Can we... Yeah, this might have been a better idea first. Just wait down here. Oh shit, they're coming. What are you doing? Stop it. Woo! <laughs> Where are they? What are they hitting? I'm not done talking to you. Stop yelling. You're annoying. Okay, are we good? Alright, little sister. Let's go find another way, please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, getting 40 is a paltry sum that we could be. God damn. All those places just did a bigger number on me than <laughs> the Rumbler. So, the Gatherer's Garden. Ooh, actually, the Gatherer's Garden. I might need to change some stuff up here real fast. Um, some of the stuff's pretty good. I mean, you mostly get upgrades for things, as well as, I guess, a couple extras. Yeah, these are actually going to be really good. I'm probably going to come back after I save my little sister, and I get things situated a little bit more with Adam. But for the most part, let's grab this, because there's still a lot of stuff we can grab. Except right now, we don't really have that great of gene tonics. I don't know. Uh, that was a bad idea. Uh, oh, Electro Bolt 2 is actually really good, too. It's probably going to be one of our better upgrades, but I'm going to hold off on that because I still want to be able to buy stuff for when we get our other thing. And there we go. There we go. So I'll change these up because there's actually going to be quite a few plasmids, or, or plasmids, gene tonics that we'll be getting soon. I would like to use once we get them. So I say we can probably start going towards that other course, but like I said, there's like four restaurants in this place that we can go visit and loot and grab things out of. And the new weapon that we get in this area is actually pretty neat, in my opinion. Oh, well that's pretty neat there, bro. So, uh, my name is Allison Cruz, you guys, and uh, welcome to this lovely game. So far, I still have not uploaded the first episode of this, Mafia 2, or The Wonderful 101, but you guys have probably already seen a significant amount of those. 
So we'll be we'll be dealing with that in a in a timely fashion ish, I suppose. Um. So there's a lot that we can do here. I don't know why this woman is sleeping next to a bunch of caliber bullets. And we'll drop down. Oh, so another god. So it looks like an, another person hung themselves. Just like the calendar, it hung itself. So let's see. <laughs> the calendar hung itself. I don't know. Oh, you know what I need to be playing right now instead of this? I need to play some Fallout 3. I keep forgetting I need to update that. Because there's gonna be like five videos on, or five series on the channel. Oh my god. That you guys are gonna be seeing. I don't know. I guess that leaves a bit of variety, but I don't know. They're all. I don't know, I guess. I'm hoping at this point you guys are seeing Majora's Mask. That would be nice. But Nintendo has been being pricks about things, about. I don't know. Just content in general. It's like, well, they have the right to do this. Well, yeah, everybody has the right to do things, but. The way you're going about doing it is is incomprehensible compared to like other companies. I don't know. You know, we haven't picked up an audio diary yet. It's a little unnerving. So what I'm gonna do here? Oh. How did you know I was here? You walked into my trap and then you turned to me, asshole. Okay, let's. Ooh, handyman. Okay, when your security friends take a bullet for you, oh, you can put them in tip-top shape with a bit of Eve. I'll probably do that just because, just to show it off, you can use Eve to heal your uh, robot buddies. And some of these we don't really need, so I'll just switch it out and let's grab this. Well, Mr. Diary, Mom's got a new security system to stop me from seeing Amir and the other kids. But security's just made of bits and bobs, like you are. And now we're the best of friends. Isn't that right? Anyway, Amir's got a whole book about the surface. It has India and Ireland and... and everywhere. Yes, all right, Mr. Diary. If you must know, I do think Amir's kind of pretty <laughs> for a dog eater. Aww. Oh no! Retreat! Eleanor, come back here at once. <laughs> 